This is an electric lamp post with a background sky, one of the most hard and complicated images to remove the background from. Now, for example, if we use common tools in Affinity Photo like the Flood Select tool and apply it, then delete it from the keyboard, no. This process will take a lot of time, and yet the result will not be good. It will either miss or take extra parts, or miss many areas. Now let's try Affinity Photo's new updated AI background tool, which is really a strong tool to easily solve most backgrounds. So try it, Affinity AI Object Selection Tool. Click it and wait for a few seconds. Here, AI completely failed to understand, select, and remove the background. Try another Affinity Photo background removal process. Go to Select Select Subject. Yet again, AI completely failed. So, as I told you earlier, this type of image is one of the hardest and most complicated images to remove the background from. To solve this, how can we do it when even AI can't help remove the background properly, as AI has failed? So let's get started to show the process. And yes, here we need a manual human touch process. First, select your image and go to image channels. Now here, select the composite blue channel. Click on it. Now only the composite blue channel is activated, and the rest of the red and green channels are disabled. From the keyboard, press Ctrl plus L, and bring up the Levels option. Now the important part. Increase the black level slide bar. Decrease the white level slide bar. Please note, here, always keep the black levels ratio higher than the white level slide bar. For example, if your black level ratio is 50, then keep the white level ratio at 45. And you must see the image in your canvas turn into a negative that looks black and white. And remember, here the black area will be removed, and white parts will remain. So take your time and do it carefully. Now my final ratio here I used. Black level ratio, 58%. White level ratio, 55%. Close the levels box. Now right click on. Composite blue channel. And click add to pixel selection. This will select all the white parts to keep them, and all the rest of the black area will be removed. Go to Layers. Activate the image layer. And add a mask. Now hide the Levels Adjustment layer. Still, it's looking like this because our composite blue channel is activated. Go to Channels. See this above on the right side, a bent arrow? Click on it as Reset. Then press Ctrl plus D to deselect, and done. Perfect. If you found this video helpful, check out the next video on your screen. You'll enjoy it. Also, take a look at the amazing video playlist organized on this channel. Please don't forget to like, share, and comment with your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next one.